think why is it so windy? Y'all sure y'all don't want to go bowling? Since it's so windy out? holiday weekend is Labor Day and the boys have been doing really good in school and having a great time so I'm gonna take them to get toys from Target because they don't want to go bowling they don't want to do activities they just want toys and just walk around maybe get some ice cream some pizza and uh, get them Bobby, out the house can we get the tiger boots yes, yes. that you've been asking for yes have, uh, so I just wanted to treat them because I know how school is I didn't like school I don't even know if y'all can hear me because of the wind but hopefully to treat them so you know school feels fun like it's a reward for doing good things so that's what we're doing today our old neighborhood and every time six wants to go to target he says can i go to the store by my dad's house day. yeah he loves going to target can we go to the store by my dad's house it's target your mommy says what no, I'm six. Your mommy says what? Um, uh, you, you say I love you. <laughs> I do say I love you all the time, huh? Because I do. And, uh, I look rich, thank you. <laughs> I told them I'm not rich, so don't go crazy. And he said, How are you not rich and you look rich? <laughs> it's all in the aesthetic. <laughs> Gotta portray what you want to be in life. I actually really miss this neighborhood. Everything was like so close. Different times of my life. It's crazy. Like when I'm in this neighborhood, I think back as to like how different everything is now. Like me and his dad would be walking this block going to Target. And Trevor would take him to buy... $400 worth of toys at one time, which is why he's so spoiled. <laughs> I have PTSD from the times when he was young in this Target. Y'all remember how he used to act when he did not get his way and y'all judge me so bad for it. And look at him now. He adjusted himself. I didn't have to whoop his ass. <laughs> They're right here. How did you just pass them? Is this not Gujitsu's? There's a shark Fujitsu. The shark is right there. I have that one. You do not have the shark. I think Dash has the shark. No, I have it. Oh. Well, figure out what which one you want. You have Volcano Blaster. He's up there. But I know the names of these things. It's so funny. Six feet. You don't want either of these either? That's the one you want? Um, I already have a shark and a Volcano Blaster. Wait, don't you already have that one? Um, no. Oh. So you have Volcano Blaster. Oh, dinosaur. Oh, and they have Volcano Blast. Volcano Blast. I'm I do sorry. Not I feel like blast. that's close enough. Mm, no. Is that all green? Okay, Idris, Six is, has his toy picked out with your poison. Pick your poison. Oh, Six, there's another oh, one up here. I know this guy. Literally, I saw, I was watching YouTube okay. today. Of course, it started storming in the middle of our adventure. So now we're in the house because hurricane season in Miami what can you do but they're happy with their toys so that's all that matters the room's a mess per usual he's distracted he's distracted and at some point we'll have lunch it's just chill <laughs> but this looks like all our day is gonna be because thunderstorms for the rest of the day we pretty much ended up getting rained out yesterday so we kind of chilled at home today is Labor Day so no school, but he does have some homework, so we need to do that because, yeah, he's in school now, so I have to be responsible, I'm more responsible than I've been, um, which I'm not ready for. Mommy, this is a teacher. No, but I need a bigger book, like a big one. Um, I can, I can see. Just grab a big book off the shelf. <laughs> <laughs> like, it doesn't even take me serious. But um, I made breakfast this morning and we kind of just been chilling because 
We really don't have Labor Day plans. We'll probably just go to the pool. Let me ever get ready to see how homework goes because I'm not ready for that. One plus one. If Johnny has two apples and I eat one, I'm not ready for that. So we'll see how our first homework session. I mean, we actually did do a school project, but that was like fun because I made a little mouse out of clay. And it was really simple, but this is like a writing project. And I'm like, you can't fucking write. That's why I sent him to y'all. <laughs> Labor Day went very good. We had a good time. We just grilled and chilled with our family. Um, I forgot to tell you guys that six was starting a new school because I just was not happy with the other school. And uh, it's going good so far, but I'll give a real update when he's been there long enough. Because now they go to the same school, so whenever I leave in the morning, I just ask Idris' mom, does he want me to pick up or drop off? The, sip, the brothers and sisters there there's like four of them and they're really good kids so I never mind having them but how cute is that oh shit I didn't even see you <laughs> you better stay away from me it's so funny living in Miami I think I probably say this all the time but this shit is really just a little mini jungle oh hi little baby you are so cutie pies don't get close because we don't want to scare them into the road but they're very cute not gonna bother you, mama. Back from the grocery store, and this is not going to be a cooking vlog. <laughs> but um, basically, I switched to school because he was going to school at a museum, and I felt like they were putting more energy into keeping the museum super exclusive. So, like, I wasn't allowed to walk inside and walk into class, or I had no idea who the principal was, and. Uh, then when the homework time started to come about, I felt like it was slightly too advanced. So like they were practicing, he has the same like writing practices at this school too. However, the first two letters are traceable and then the next letters are do it yourself. They were sent at home, just do it yourself stuff. And then she also sent me an email complaining that he wasn't getting good at his writing. I'm like, all right, well, obviously. And now he's, already doing so good because it's somewhat muscle memory like let me trace two and do the other two by myself and then the last thing just was that like that was pretty much it like I had no idea what was going on at this school ever you can't walk inside there's no like office area because it's a it was attached to a museum and so now he goes to school where his friend is which is great because I help his mom out in the morning picking them up and in the afternoons if she needs it. And he has somebody at the school and his teacher now, he has a black teacher, he had a Spanish teacher at first, not that that makes a difference, but the teacher has given me like a week update and I asked her how she was doing and she said, he's making a lot of friends and he seems so excited about the work that we're doing, which is great because he was not excited about the work at first. He was getting frustrated, like the teacher said, and refusing to do it. So I'm not sure if the teacher's just more attentive or the school just has a different curriculum, but we wanna do all we can. And then also like, I was gonna have to find sports outside the school. Like I said, this the other school focused so much on it just being the museum, We're a children's museum where you take your families during the day. They didn't even have like sports team. This school has sports teams. So he's gonna do basketball twice a week. And then when he's not doing basketball, if the days align, we're gonna do soccer twice a week. Keep him busy. And I was happy that his new teacher said that he seems really, really excited about learning. And I could tell in the difference between the first time we were doing homework at the other school and the second time, it seems like somebody's there, either one, breaking it down a little better or two, the tracing first is just helping him comprehend more. You like your new school? What have you been doing? The kids at the other school were very loud. Mm -hmm. Maybe because you have a black teacher now and you don't play. <laughs> Maybe that's it. What are you learning though? How much letters mm -hmm. and about healthy fruits. Healthy what? Fruits. Healthy fruits and vegetables. Did you learn about reflexes today? Because you brought up reflexes to me. 
Oh no, we're actually watch Fitzy's until it says reflex. Oh, you were watching something that told you about reflexes? Uh -huh. Okay. You excited about starting basketball? Mm -hmm. You want to do soccer too? Why is that soccer too? Do you want to do both? You can do both. No. Which one you want to do? Oh, well, obviously he wants to do soccer, but we're going to do both so we can see which one he brings me some money in for. But I'm going to start dinner and get him ready for bed. That is it. Until next time.